There are two major techniques that popular antivirus programs use these days. The first is signature based and it works by comparing your file to a large number of known threats and antivirus programs share these databases of known threats. So if your file matches it, it's flagged. If it doesn't, it's not flagged as a threat. So hackers can easily bypass this by making their files more unique so that they don't match any known threats. The second and better and smarter technique to detect threats is based on the behavior of the file and hence the name behavior analysis. And in this technique, the antivirus program will analyze the behavior of your file. And if it does anything suspicious, such as communicating with a C2 instance or modifying registry, then it flags it as a threat, even if its code doesn't match any existing known threats. And that's why your antivirus sucks because it relies on detection. Therefore, anybody with a bit of skills and patience will be able to bypass it. So it's not really an issue with the antivirus or EDR itself, but it's more of an issue with the idea of using detection for defense. Hackers will always be able to find ways to bypass it, even if it is cleverly based on the behavior of the file. And if you don't believe me, just watch the rest of the video. And don't worry, we're going to talk about a solution that you can use to secure yourself and your organizations properly from undetectable threats. Check out the full YouTube video to see exactly how to do this step by step.